Maybe I was moving too fast. You know, whatever. You start doubting yourself. I focus on me. Hey guys, it's C. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. And y'all, we sitting down, we on the couch, we got the tea. Y'all already know it's another life check with C. So I wanted to come in and talk about this. I was just um, in the kitchen, I was cooking, filming another video, and it came to me about trusting the process. And this comes from, you know, just my thoughts my fears my doubts basically over this last week about this process who to lay and when i tell you it's so hard to trust the process so so hard so i was like let me come on and talk to the people today because this is for me y'all already know these life checks be for me <laughs> but um i wanted to talk about this mug um shout out to my brother Jawan KP for this mug. He got he got three mugs. Two were for me and one were for Bay. I did a reel on it. I'll put it on the side of the screen. But I thought this one was definitely fitting for this life check. And it says, "What is meant for you won't pass you by." And that goes all in with trusting the process and the teas I have in case. Y'all want to know. Um, I have three different teas because y'all already know I can't just have one tea. I have the Focus Tea. And that one is by uh, Twinings. Focus Tea. I have the Herbal Cup. And it's the Anti-Stress and um, Ashwagandha Tea. And then I have the Organic Great Value Ginger and Turmeric Tea. So, yeah, all three of those are in here. Okay, so now that that's all out of the way. So... If you are new here and you don't know, I used to be a teacher and I'll pop my video here, um, well, both videos here and link them below if you want to hear about my story of how I was a teacher and I quit teaching to pursue this content creation, full-time content creation journey. So, yeah, um, but yeah, I used to be a teacher and I decided, you know, I lost my passion for it and I decided to pursue my new passion which is content creation and so i have been on this journey i quit teaching my last day of teaching was june 3rd um well it is now january and so i um started doing content creation my first youtube video was september 8th 2021 so i've been in this journey a little over a year and a half now and so i've been trying to trust the process things are not going as well as i thought they were going I, I thought they were going to go uh, or as well as I hoped they would go. Um, I have not gotten my goal. Y'all already know y'all been here. If you've been here, you know I've been having a goal to get monetized um, at the end of last year. Didn't happen, but I'm still, again, trying to trust this process. So um, <laughs> I also wanted to say a few people have asked me. People ask me online. People ask me in person um, if I would ever go back to teaching again. And... I can't even sit here and lie to y'all and tell y'all the thought didn't cross my mind. Because life be life and y'all already know life be a lifer. And sis ain't used to this kind of lifestyle. Sis used to going to work on somebody's clock getting a check on the regular. And sis has not been getting a check on the regular. So trust and believe it has crossed my mind. Now, would I, would I go back? Simple, short answer. No, absolutely not. No way in the world because I left for a reason. I left because I knew that my passion had left and I was doing those kids a disservice by not being the effective teacher that I knew I could be. Um, and I could affect the funk and all kinds of stuff, but that's not what I do. So, absolutely not. Could not go back. Have I thought about getting another job? Absolutely. <laughs> we, we real over here. We, <laughs> we real over here. I'm trying to tell you, we real over here. Yes, I have thought about getting another job. Um, but I just know it's, it's, it's not it's not for me. It's not for me. Um, now, I would say if I got like a contractor type job, it would be specific to content creation, then yes. But going back to a job just for the sake of having a job, I can't do it. As much as it has crossed my mind, who to lay? Definitely been on Indeed. <laughs> Definitely been on Monster.com. You know, just being real. But 
I can't do it. I, I, I just, I can't do it. So, no, I will not be going back in the classroom to teach. If you, if I um, go back in the classroom, it would definitely be for a uh, um, speaking engagement. If somebody wants me to come and speak, you know, do like a motivational speech or whatever to the kids. Absolutely. I go back in the classroom for that all day, every day. But to teach, absolutely not. Um, but I said all this to say I had to go back to trust in the process. When I announced that, um... <clears throat> that I was not going back to teaching and that I was pursuing content creation full time. One of my friends, Jessica, shout out to you, Jess. She and her husband are the owners of Eating with the G's. Um, they have amazing food, desserts, everything. I'll link their pages below. But yeah, um, Jess, she commented and well, I think she texted me this and she was like, Yes, yes, ma'am, I'm proud of you, all this stuff, all this stuff. And then in her message, she said, trust the entire process and when she said it i was like yes ma'am i'm sure will definitely whatever but listen times whew, it sound all cute yeah trust the process trust the process but when you get into the nitty-gritty and you get in this process and it ain't looking like you expected it to look and it ain't going like you expected it to go it gets hard to trust the process and ultimately that that trust for me I trust in God. So, ultimately, it comes from trusting God. Like, all right, God. Now, I know I done prayed and asked, and asked for guidance, asked for strategy, asked for clarity, you know, to make sure, asked for confirmation from the very beginning to make sure this is what you want me to do. Now, I'm trying to trust you, but what's up? Like, what's up? That's, that's how we talk. All right, now. Like, please tell me. Tell me. Help me. <laughs> It gets hard. I ain't gonna lie to you. It gets really hard, and you know, I, it's hard to not try, not feel defeated. I've talked about not being defeated and all kind of stuff in previous videos. If you have not checked out my life check playlist, there is a playlist on um, under my videos or whatever that can let you see all the life check videos. But yeah, I've talked about being defeated. I've talked about you know wanting everything to be perfect, which is one another reason why I put this shirt on today. Growth is greater than perfection. Y'all already know that's that's my thing merch below um merch buy some merch below growth is greater than perfection because i'm telling y'all it's it's a struggle it's a struggle i've been trying to search this process i've been trying to nitpick get things perfect you know trying to um sell merch trying to get my website together y'all have been along a little bit seeing me trying to get my website together to start offering these services that i want to offer but the the main thing is to get monetized like and I've been trying to trust this process, but looking at these numbers go up and then go down, go up and then go down and start creeping, like, it's hard to trust the process. And I know all of you that are watching are in different areas of life. You may be trying to trust the process of getting done with school, trust the process of being a parent, trust the process of being in a relationship, trust the process of starting a new business, whatever it is that, that you're in that is looking like, ooh, chale, like, it's, it's hard. It's hard. I'm here to tell you, trust the process, friend. And I know it's easier said than done. Because, listen, I'm in it. I'm in it right now. I, ooh, I'm in it. <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all. I know it's easier said than done. Because I keep telling myself, girl, be for real. Be for real. <laughs> no, for real. Like, I know it's easier said than done, but keep trusting the process. I know it's all going to work out in the end. I know it's all going to work out. Like... I know what God told me. If you know what God told you, you know you've gotten confirmation. You know you've prayed and you really heard from God and he told you this is what you're supposed to be doing or he gave you everything you need, just keep trusting. Just keep trusting. God knows it is hard to do. But it's going to be worth it in the end. It's going to be worth it. And that's what I keep telling myself. One, I know what God told me. It may not look like what I thought it would look like, but I know what God told me. So I'm going to keep trusting this process. And I know that I've been doing the work. If you know you've been doing the work and you've been giving it all you got and you've been doing what it takes to get to where you're trying to go, keep trusting. Now, if you've been out here being slack and all kinds of stuff and not what you're supposed to be doing, trust the process, but get on your job because you, your process could be held up because of you. Just saying. But, <laughs> I mean, I know I've been doing what I'm supposed to be doing. But sometimes it's 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 like, all right, this ain't moving like I need to be moving. Did I hear God correct? Because then you start questioning yourself. God, did I really hear you like 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 I thought I heard you? Knowing that you got all the confirmation <laughs> that you need. 
God, did I really, maybe I was moving too fast. You know, whatever. You start doubting yourself. You start doubting yourself. But I'm here to tell you, don't doubt yourself. Trust the process. Trust no matter how hard it gets. Because at the end of the day, if you don't trust the process, let's say you, you like, you know what, it is what it is, I, I give up. Now you right back to where you were before you started this process. And you know where you were before you started this process was worse than what where you are now. Cause I know for me, I didn't want to be, I didn't want to be a teacher no more. So what if I, what I look like giving all this up? Because this is what I love to do. Giving all this up to go back to being stuck, go back to feeling unfulfilled, go back to not do, feel, fulfilling my purpose. Why would I go back to that and then get stuck in a rut and then figure out, okay, I re, let me just go back and to start all back over again. Mm -mm, we ain't starting back over. We're gonna finish this process. We gonna, cause ain't no way I'm about to start back over and try to trust the process again. And be even further behind. Ain't no way I'm about to do that. And you ain't about to do that either. We not about to do that, friend. 2023, I said it, I said it in the last video. This going to be the year. We going to do what we got to do. We going to reach what we need to reach. But we got to do the work. But we also got to trust the process. It may not be in the time that we think it should be. Or be the way we think it should be. But as long as we keep doing what we're supposed to be doing, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. God knows. I know. Like I said, I know it's hard. I know it's hard for him, but just trust the process. You got this. You got this. And I know sometimes, you know, you people tell you you got this. Because I know I have to tell myself, you got this. And I'll be like, no, do I really? <laughs> I don't think I do. <laughs> and you might feel like, I really don't. I ain't got it. I ain't got it. <laughs> I ain't got it. But you do. <laughs> you really do. And it's, it's a hard road. Sometimes it's a long road. Definitely feels like a long road. But it's going to happen. <laughs> we just got to trust the process. So don't give up, friend. Don't go back to what you know was not fulfilling you. Don't go back to the life that you know that's not what you want. And you working hard now to get to the life that you know you want to have. Keep doing it. Keep going. Keep going. You got it. You got it. I promise you. You got it. And God got you. God got you. And you know that because you never would have started it if you didn't think you did. Am I right? Or am I right? Again, my cup says what is meant for you won't pass you by so if it's meant for you it's gonna be for you now like i said keep putting in the work don't slack off don't get lazy don't get defeated don't stop keep going because what's meant for you won't pass you by it's gonna it's gonna run right into you but you gotta be running you gotta trust the process you gotta keep going but it's gonna happen for you god knows like i said i know it's hard and i keep saying that because it is it we for real like it's hard it's really hard sometimes but it's gonna happen but yeah i just wanted to come on here and be quick and say this i know y'all probably like girl quick where <laughs> let me see yeah quick where anywho yeah i just want to come on here and say that because it was on me because you know it's hard sometimes like i'm telling y'all yeah i be in my head like i be in my head a lot about what's not happening the way I feel like it should happen, but I'm I'm gonna continue to trust the process. But most importantly, I'm gonna continue to trust God to do what He said He would do. So you gonna trust with me and keep going. I would love for you to keep going, keep trusting, keep believing, keep doing what you know you need to do because it's gonna pay off. And when you get to the other side and you over there like God, I think I thank God I trusted Him and I thank Him I trusted this process because now I ain't back where I was. And even more, I ain't back where I was before I even started this process. I already know, because ain't no way starting over again. Can't do it. Can't do it. So I'm going to trust this process. What about you? But, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up, y'all. But, again, trust the process, friend. Trust the process. It's going to happen for you. Just trust it. Do do your part. Keep doing it. Don't be weary and well-doing. Y'all know the scripture. I'm going to pop it on the screen. Don't be weary and well-doing. You know what you're doing is good. And it's right, and it's going to help you and, and potentially help other people. And you know that it's going to be good for your life. Don't be weary and well-doing. I'm talking to me, too. But, yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. But I hope y'all enjoyed this live check. Again, trust the process, friend. It's, it's going to work out for you. It's going to work out for you. I promise it is. I know it's going to work out for me. No matter how hard it may be. No matter how much I don't believe it some days. I know it's going to happen for me. I know it is. I know it's going to happen for you, too. So let's keep doing what we got to do and let's keep trusting the process and not being weary and well doing. Make sure you go look at those other videos that I told y'all about. And also I want to mention some channels um, that I follow. I'm going to put them 
all below for y'all to go and check out because i'll be meaning to put this in my description bar but I, I never do sometimes but yeah look in the description bar below if you want if you're looking for some new people to follow and subscribe to and watch their vlogs too in addition to my my channel i love these people so definitely check them out below i'm going to list them below and tag them so that you can go straight to their page but as always thank y'all for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and share this video with somebody and i'll see y'all in the next one bye guys love y'all